you know, mm-hmm. particularly in Division Two, Division Three football, there's a lot of places that aren't very stable, whether it's the university itself or whether it's the football program. Um, but, you know, it's a place I want to be for a long time as an alumni. And I purposely made the made the choice to hire coaches I thought would stay for a while. Not that if they didn't get a great opportunity, they wouldn't take it. But um, I wanted guys that could stay somewhere four years and develop the kids over that course of four years and not constantly have change and influx. Um, and, you know, that's really my sell to the parents is we're going to take care of them and grow and mature them. And as far as to what we're looking for, I think first and foremost, any level of football, I don't care if it's the NFL, um, you want to find guys that love the game. Right. Um, and everyone will say that it's easier said than done figuring out if a, if a kid really does love it or not. Um, but typically that's the first quality we're looking for. Then um, I've always felt it was a, it's disingenuous to say I'm going to change the culture of a team or I'm going to change the character of the team. Uh, to a degree you can, but I think the, the bigger aspect you better do is is find the right character kids in the first place in the recruiting process. So mm-hmm. uh, we spend a lot of time getting into the weeds on that on 